My furnace is blowing lukewarm air. What can I do to fix this? If you're lucky, it is just a supersized fur ball, or debris blocking the airflow. That's not lucky, that's a fire hazard. If you find it and remove it now, before the house burns down, that is lucky. What's another cause? If you're lucky, you have an electric furnace with a dying heating element, such as two or three heating elements and one died. Just replace the heating element, and you're good to go. It may be a gas furnace. Then you'll want to get electric heaters, until you get it fixed. Because problems with gas furnaces are dangerous. It's not hot enough, not getting too much fuel. If there is a gas leak, the furnace may not get enough fuel to heat your house. But a gas buildup could cause the house to eventually explode. Or it could be leaking out, somewhere else. So you're generating a gas leak, that could blow up the exposed pipe in the front yard. You still want to turn off the gas, if you think there is a gas leak. Now I really hope I have an electrical furnace. Check the furnace for power. It might be turned off, and you're just getting warm and recirculated through the house. Trust me, I would never turn it off in the winter. If you had a bunch of other electrical appliances on, the breaker to the furnace might have tripped. Then the furnace is off until you turn it back on or reset it. If in doubt, reboot it. If not kick it. If it turns off shortly after you reboot it, call in a professional, because there's another problem going on. I wonder if it is the heat exchanger. That is pretty much the least likely thing to malfunction on a furnace. Even American Standard gives that part a lifetime warranty, which is 4 or more years longer than the rest of the unit. We have a premium brand, high efficiency furnace. Maybe your two-stage furnace simply had the second stage motor go out or the second stage heating element. So what seems like a heater giving me the cold shoulder, is just the same performance it had before, because the second stage cannot kick in. And I do not recommend kicking a furnace at any point, since you're more likely to damage it. Aside from the heating element, what else could it be? One of the blower motors might have gone out, or the thermostat is broken. If the thing thinks it is 70 degrees already, it won't turn up the juice, even if the water in the pipes is freezing. I've already turned up the thermostat on the wall. I'm talking about the thermostat built into the furnace. Or it could be an electrical short, or glitch somewhere else. So now we're back to calling it pro, and getting it checked out, and turning it off if you smell gas or burning anything. Now all I have to worry about, is how big a hole this will burn in my wallet. Better than in your wall.